Oh hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Kobe Scrubby and welcome to Tribe Primitive Builder. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me tonight. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoy the stream, don't forget to follow the channel, turn on notifications, and if you'd like to support the channel, avoid the ads, and join my private satisfactory server and come play along with us if you want to. You can subscribe for $5 for free with a Twitch Prime by connecting your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account. You get one free Prime subscription per month, and you can choose to use it here. The only other way is if you're lucky, maybe you'll get gifted a sub. If you're watching on YouTube later, uh, same thing. If you want to use the join button to become a channel member, you can join the server that way as well. What's going on, Clockwork? Good to see you here. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, let me check something here. Is that chat just way too small? Let's try this. Hmm. Oh crap, now it's not working. Why is it not working? Uh oh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Been using up the last couple of days of my vacation, going crazy on the server. Man, I wish I had, well, at least I got, I got started early today. Dude, I tried so hard to, uh, to, uh, be able to get on here earlier today. Uh, but man, there just wasn't time. I was going to get on here for like a couple hours and maybe I could have gotten on the server or something, but man, I just did not have time. Yeah, I know, man. The last, the last couple days of vacation, I started getting angry because I got to go back to work. <laughs> hate, I hate it, man. I hate, I hate what, I hate the kind of work I do, I suppose. I mean, I don't mind working. I put in the hours, you know, I'll do this for eight, ten hours a day if I have to. <laughs> but uh, I'm just so exhausted with the work that I do. I've done for so long, I don't want to do it anymore. Anyway, let's check this game out. Um, this is another demo that I have. It's called Tribe Primitive Builder. And we'll see what it's all about uh, later the on. Isle of the Banished. Okay, I'll tell the you later. Fortunate end of my journey. You'd think that I'm the leader of this quest, or at the very least, <laughs> the leader's helper. No. All my life, I thought they were my brothers, but now they will see to my banishment. Fools. They say I deserve this, but they have not had to live with the vision of our doom. Since I was a boy, I constantly played with sticks. I saw their potential and ways to connect them that others thought impossible. The gods were good to me, so our village grew. I'm the sorry it's so loud. I, I, I swear I turned everything but down. The village was not enough. I was convinced that the gods expected more from me. Haunted by the vision of doom, I decided to build an altar that reached the sky. I thought that would appease them, but gods had different plans for me. They split the sky in two and consumed all my work. Oh no! I was banished for offending them. Me, the only one who knew the truth. Only upon seeing the flaming rocks on the Isle of the Banished up close, the truth revealed itself to me. The gods wanted me to end up here. This game seems like it's aware that it's like a little bit silly too. Yeah, there's a city builder, uh, Dawn of Man, that's like primitive type city builder uh, that I like a lot. Um, and of course, Ark and 
things like that. Let's see. You know, the game could look amazing, but you just never know unless you play it if it just feels right. You know, I've I've bought I've played plenty of games where I'm like, this is gonna be amazing, and I play it, and it should be everything that I love, and I'm just like, uh, eh, I just it I just not feeling it. Uh let's see. Fisherman. Heh. <laughs> Another day, another exile. You better prove yourself useful. Come on, did they exile you? Did they exile your mouth too? Can you even talk? I share your tongue. Good. Talk to the chieftain. Elder will see if you're useful or not. Go through the fire cave. You will have to jump from a hanging rock to find our people. You don't jump, you die. Simple as that. Yes, simple. Simple, true. We're not feeding anyone who doesn't contribute. So, contribute. This one time, I give you fish. Cook them over my fire. You look weak, like a mouse. I don't like mouse. Mouse, scary. You have my thanks, stranger. Dishonest, what's going on? Yeah, like, right, right when I went live, I saw that uh, the notification and I kind of read through it quickly uh, because I'd already started the stream so what what now they're they're smoking in the car with the newborn baby that doesn't seem like a good idea dumb man's a good one there's also one the project of a solo dev called sapiens I have heard of that I have not played it though I don't think Tribal dudes with masks kind of remind me of an old Ubisoft title called From Dust. Oh, whoa. Ooh, unstuck. Um, that kind of has a, a familiar sound to it, too, but I don't think I've played that one. Dude. have lung issues and they want to smoke in the car with me oh yeah 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 I didn't I didn't get to read it all the way I was just trying to skim through it real quick before I turned my camera on and I was that's what my first thought was they're gonna smoke in the car with the baby <laughs> but yeah I mean you got you got the whole rest of the day to smoke as much as you want you know if somebody Needs you to not smoke around them for what? How long was the car ride? 10, 20, 30 minutes? Like, you'll live. Just hold on. <laughs> okay. It feels good. Is this motion blur? The motion blur is kind of... Head bobbing, field of view... Graphics, motion blur, let's turn that down a bit. That's just, the motion blur is cool, but I feel like this is just a little bit easier to look at. It feels really nice though. Uh, uh oh, that didn't feel nice. All right, I have a fish. I'm supposed to cook the fish. This guy peeing in the water. Have you talked to the chieftain? Not yet. Okay, let's cook the fish. Didn't they accuse me of breaking the navigator when navigators had issues since we got it because the last owner spilled coffee everywhere? Even on the ceiling? <laughs> I have always... Turned off motion blur, never understood the appeal. In some games, it, it looks kind of cool. Like, for example, in Ark, when you're flying on a Pteranodon and the wings have motion blur to them, it's kind of cool. In some games, it's just hard to look at. And I think especially for for you guys, for viewers, um, I, I've watched people play games with motion blur on too, and I feel like it's harder to watch when you're a viewer. Um, so sometimes they do it good. Sometimes it's just not great. How do we do this? One, two, three, craft. 
Spi spicy food rations? Eat or deliver to the tribe's storage cave for the other tribesmen. Dude, I feel like this game's gonna be awesome. I hope it's good. Speed up time, which it takes... Uh, items are crafted. Building costs less energy. Oh no, we need energy to build. Reduces fatigue while using the axe. Reduces fatigue while gathering. Increases spear throwing power. Reduces fatigue while using pickaxe. Dude, I feel like this game's gonna be awesome. Oh, look at that! This is kind of like Skyrim. Axe, knife. So wait, what if I do this? Oh! Did I just upgrade something? I did not mean to do that. I just wanted to look. Required one of zero items to unlock talisman. Oh, okay, it's not. Okay, also one more thing. The ambient, like the water. Oh, dude, I turned these down before I started. Were you guys here the other night when it wasn't going down and I was just like, apply, 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 apply. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's better. Yeah, man, I, I, I still think... I still think uh, if your therapist has got something for you, I really think, because you're, you're 24, right? I really think uh, if you could be on your own, you know? Because you've never lived alone before, right? Um, you kind of, I feel like it would be to, to, to not like get away from them, but to like kind of put a little space, you know, cause it seems like they're pretty hard on you just because they got no one else to blame is what it kind of seems like. I don't know, man. It just kind of feels like that. Obviously I only know what you tell me, but. Offer to sell all my stuff for them, then suddenly it was working again. <laughs> it has a habit of freezing for hours and working again. Been waiting for a call from his contact, Brian. Yeah. I I think it would be would be good, you know, like not anything super hardcore, you know, you just kinda get a feel for having your own place and doing your own thing. You know, and not necessarily being that far away from them. You know, you can always... Oh, look, a volcano! You know, and then you got your own space. You can set up your PC. You can you can do a lot more stuff. E? If it, if it works out, I hope it does. I, I feel like that would be good. Yeah, Gathering Mastery 2. What is this stuff? Is this anything? Nothing I can do at the moment. Can I gather like wood? I'll pick all this stuff. So yeah, uh, in a little bit, sorry, I was saying when the intro came on. Oh, I need an axe? Okay. Uh, we're going to be switching over to Project Playtime whenever, uh, like, Official specifically when she gets off of work and gets here So it'll be a little bit after 10 o'clock is what it sounds like. Uh, sorry 10 o'clock my time So about two and a half hours And I believe that we need three to four more people or we don't need but we can have up to seven people So I believe we can take three to four more people if anyone's interested in playing it. It's free to play so that if we have a full party, then six people will be like the survivors. Uh, and then the one person will be the monster. Uh, let's see if we can craft stuff. How do we work this? Okay, inventory? Can we craft stuff? Alter, tribe, map? Character? T 
didn't mean to type no. <laughs> I was just like, no? I was like, what did I say? Did I ask a question? <laughs> um, I don't know how to, I don't know how to craft stuff. Let's look at... Is there a craft button? Building panel Q. Hawkeye, Hawk's eye left alt. So it looks like the baby thing went well. The baby is all good. Okay, here's my crafting. What was this? Okay, I can't do that. Private? What is that? Oh, the workshop? Okay. Food? Back? Various? Product? Various? Storage hut? Builder's hut? Toolmaker's hut? Production, gatherer's hut, shaman's hut, woodcutter's hut, potter's hut, stonecutter's hut. So it looks like we're going to need to make a workshop and then we can probably make tools in there. So let's just continue on and go where we're supposed to and I'm sure it'll tell us to build that and build some tools. Oh, I need a knife for that? Ah, I want a knife. Haven't seen her yet. Uh, my father was supposed to take 10 to 20 minutes, but he took an hour. Oh, uh, so he took up everybody else's time? I mean, I, I can see that, you know, if he's like super excited and stuff. But still, everybody else wants to see the baby too. Ah, uh, it'll be alright, you'll see. I imagine, you'll get to see the baby eventually. But that's good that it all went well. Um, because, man, having a baby can go wrong, too. Like, uh, when Laura had Will... I won't go into, like, super detail, but she ended up having, like... I don't know exactly. She was, like, hyperventilating and kind of going into shock a little bit. Like, she was cold, couldn't slow down her breathing. Um, they had to give her blood once or twice. Uh, cause she lost a lot of blood and then she was asleep for a long time after that. Like it was pretty, it was pretty hard on her to the point where we kind of feel like she shouldn't, she shouldn't, um, have any more babies because if it went like that or worse, uh, it wouldn't be good for her, um, if she would even make it. Is what I'm saying. Dude, I'm a master gatherer at picking up rocks. <laughs> My inventory is going to be so packed. So I need a pickaxe to, to do this stuff. Alright, so hopefully when I build the workbench, workshop, I'll just kind of have everything I need. And I won't have to go look for stuff. Mastery six. So, so far it feels a bit like Ark, which is awesome because I love Ark. It's one of my favorite games that I got the most time in. So that's good. It was annoying because he was drunk and wouldn't stop rubbing it in our faces. Oh, jeez. That, well, that's, that's unnecessary. All right. That's a, a bit childish. Like, haha, I got more time because I took your time. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got more rocks. Which way? We're supposed to go down, eh? Can I steal your stuff yet? Need a knife? Okay. Alright, let's talk. Ah, oh, God's giveth yet again. I was like, is this a lady? But wait, the nipples are out, so it's not. <laughs> Greetings, fellow exile. By the great birds, you look awful. I have no use for tired exiles. Go drink some water and sleep. Use my tatami for now. Come find me when your body feels stronger. I thank you, wise leader. 
All right, looks like we got some crops here. Yellow grass. Can I just steal all their stuff? What's my inventory look like? Oh, dude, I got, I can carry everything. Wow. Do I have like a weight limit? Uh, so what else are you guys up to? Herbs. What's this? I don't know what this is. Alright, let's go. What is this? Water? What the hell? I have a mask on? Get a grip before going back to the leader. Quench thirst, take a nap. Oh, my bed. It's so nice. All right, let's take a nap. Sleep for... Wait. Oh, oh, I see. It's gonna tell me how far it fills up my sleep? Okay, so as my sleep fills up, my water and food go down. Okay, so right here will be full. For 10 hours. You're starving. Build a fisherman's hut or craft spear and hunt yourself. You need a campfire to cook meat. Campfires are available near the village's village warehouse and in the cook's hut. Okay, do I have anything I can eat? Oh yeah, I do. Did these go bad? Wait. Okay, right click is eat. All right, it's almost full. Let's go drink some more water. Oh, hi. You grow stronger by the minute. I see that our little comforts do make a difference. The time has come now, fellow exile. You must build yourself a hut and something else. You're going to need tools. My workshop is right there. Should you need it, craft the necessary tools there. Everything you need to begin can be found on the island. Where can I find stones? Where can I find vines? Thank you. I've already found all that stuff. Uh, craft a knife, craft an axe. What about these guys? Are they peeing in the water? This guy kind of looks like he's peeing in the water. <laughs> You have a baby in there? Wait, stop. Is that a baby? Oh, stuff. I'll take that. <laughs> no one cares that I'm just stealing all their stuff. I love it. I love stealing stuff. <clears throat> okay. Also... Here, I got some special music for you. This is the Animal Come song from the Animal Semen video. <laughs> okay, let's see. Crude knife, crude axe, crude hammer. Alright, what do we need? An axe, a knife, a hammer. I need all this stuff. Incense? What does that do? Basic ingredient of many rituals, burn it on the altar to appease the gods. Whoops, I didn't fix my, put my chat back. <clears throat> hey, Malik's here. What's going on, man? Doing all right. I'm playing, uh, I'm playing that tribe game. It's pretty cool so far. Started watching regular show again, and I really miss it. Regular show? I don't know that one. I never heard of that. Uh, knife. 
craft. Axe. Hammer. Oh, what am I missing? I'm missing vines. Okay. So let's put knife, axe, hammer, incense. I need some vines. Does this have durability? Oh, it does. The little orange on the knife on my hotbar down there is going down. He can't wait for the new Dead Island. Yeah, I... Me too. I think that I've... I'm kind of feel... When I'm waiting for new games, I just kind of don't think about it because... I feel like we've just been burned by so many new games in the last few years. That are like super hyped up and we're super excited for. And then they come out and they suck. So I'm just kind of, I kind of don't think about it. And then when they come out, I have lower expectations. And then I feel like sometimes maybe the game is better. Whereas if I get super hyped for it, then if it doesn't live up to it, then it's worse. You remember that I have a code for it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What else was, there was something else too. Wait, what? I want this in four. Okay. Hammer, three, spear. Hunting with a spear. When you spot a fish, seagull, or turkey, aim your spear and throw it to get a valuable resource. Press while holding a spear to aim. Left while aiming to throw. Alt to use hawk's eye to find the spear. <gasps> Cool. All right, well, let's go do some stuff. Wait, there was another way to go back here. I am going to need some more food here pretty quickly. Give me all your vines. So I think my tiredness is going down, or I'm getting more tired. The Z one on the bottom left. As I'm doing this. I do need a pick. Can I use a hammer? Nope. Oh, Callista Protocol? Callisto? Never played it, opened it, but never played it fully. The only games I've been excited about were the New Life New Life of Strange True Colors and The Last of Us Part 2 and Part 1 that just came out. I remember when I had a job, I used to listen to the full Last of Us cutscenes and think about me acting it out. You can see that. Uh... I mean, games like No Man's Sky, Assassin's Creed, I mean, even back to Assassin's Creed Origin, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I mean, I was just talking about the other night how I was so excited for Origins that I bought the $100 Ultimate Edition, so I'd have the, I'd have the uh, Season Pass and everything, and I only played it for like two hours, and then quit, never played it again for years, and then played it again like 
a year ago. And then only played it for a couple hours and then quit again and uh uh No Man's Sky, what else was there? Uh Find the Elder? There were I, I can't think of them right now. There were other games that I was super hyped for and they came out and I got them and I'm like, ah oh, man, this kind of like it's not horrible, but I was super hyped for it and it kind of sucks. Oh hi. I see you have crafted yourself some mighty tools. Good. Now it's time to build a hut. I need my men well rested. I find them more useful that way. Best find a place beneath sunlight. Now you will need wood. Wood and bamboo. Search outside. Follow the path. Should be easy enough. Just look to your right. Look to your right and be vigilant. The vines grow in on cave exits. You'll find them helpful when constructing. We'll talk later. Let the gods guide your path. If you want to save time, you can check our storage. You'll find excess resources there. There may be enough to help you. I already stole all your resources, man. Build the workshop to get access to a rest point, crafting table, and personal storage in the desired location. Q for building panel. Left to pick uh, a hut to build. Okay. All right, let's go. Do, do, do. Wait, where am I supposed to build? Grab resources. Okay, start construction of the workshop. Am I supposed to go out and, you know, find a place that I want to build my own place? Cool. Cool. Assassin's Creed, I want to get into that game. So this is what I've... Okay, so I've been playing Assassin's Creed since the first one came out in, what, like 2007 or something? I played I played all of them, um, except for Origins and uh, Odyssey. I only played those for a couple hours each. Um, and when I went back and played the first one again... At the very beginning like that, it was all about super stealth. Like, slow down, go slow, be stealthy. Um, and it took a lot of time to play it that way, which was fine. And then as the games went on, they slowly went away from stealth. And more of like, kind of be stealthy if you can, but if not, just run in and kill everybody. And then they kind of turned it at Origins. They turned it more RPG type. Um, but yeah, they're all good. They're all like historical, which I love. Like there's even questions on Laura's teacher's test that she was taking for a teacher's license. There were questions about history that I only knew because I learned while I was playing Assassin's Creed. So it's kind of cool. Um, yeah, they're definitely good. They definitely take a lot of time. They'll they'll suck your time really fast. <laughs> so Valhalla was the last one. Actually, when I started streaming more often, Valhalla was the one that I would stream every Friday. And that one's actually really good. Should I go in here? Will I be able to get back out? I feel like I don't want to get stuck down there. There was a Reddit post that said, what's the most laziest thing you've ever done? I had to post it on there because I'm a lazy sack of shit. My laziest thing I've done, I was laying down and my remote, remote, remote dropped before I switched to my phone remote app and didn't feel like getting up. So I just took a nap. Brawlhalla? No, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Odyssey is crap. Even even Origins, man. I was so excited for Origins because I I find like the Egypt type stuff fascinating. The Egypt lore. But man, I just I tried it twice. The second time I played it on stream and I kept getting claimed for the music. And which made it even harder to do. I don't know. I'm sure it's fine. 
I'm sure I would like it just fine, but I I think that I think that since I'm streaming it, it makes it harder to do. Like if I was playing it on my own time, just sitting by myself in my house, um, I, I almost kind of feel like I might enjoy it more and not be kind of, you know, cons have time constraints and all that stuff while streaming. Look at this water. All right, so water is easy to do. Where should I build my house? I guess let's just do it right here in this open area. Uh, let's just put the hut here. The workshop. The building building's spirit will turn blue when it's possible to build and the ground is flat enough. Scroll to change the rotation. Left to confirm, Q to cancel. Oh, this is like my house house. Okay. I kind of want would like it back here a little bit. Oh, wait. Am I going to want to go in? Okay, so these two are like the front. Let's do it like right here. And then we'll pick these plants. And then we're going to have to get rid of some of these trees so I can get in here. Oh, I can axe them. This is bamboo. Whoa! <laughs> oh, I can't get rid of that? Oh, that kind of sucks. Okay. Alright, how do we do this? Wood, I ha it takes one and I have 16. Oh, look at that. That's cool. That's actually pretty cool. Bamboo and vine. Whoa. I like it. More bamboo. I'm a building master, level two. Now we need grass. I already have 20. Dude, this is cool. Leaves. What is that? Yeah! So there's my bed. Chest. Workbench. This is awesome. Origins, I enjoyed the views. I want to like it so bad. And like I said, I'm sure I would if I you know, wasn't constrained by time and trying to do so many other things, you know, in between trying to go to work and sleep. In Odyssey, I will say that I have Cassandra way more, or you like Cassandra way more than Alexio views as an environment. Oh yeah. 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 I, I climbed all the way up to the top of the pyramid before <laughs> I like your voice acting better. And I think she has better facial animation. Alexio is just a big plank of wood. <laughs> Miss the old eagle eye vision. Yeah. Yeah, they changed that a bit. Uh, I mean, I guess I haven't played Odyssey enough to say I don't like it. I only played it for an hour or two. Uh, and I didn't understand because I came from... What was it? Revelations was the last one before Origins and then Odyssey. I came from Revelations into origins only played it for a little bit and never went back to it. Then Odyssey came out. I pre-ordered that 
I played that for an hour or two and I didn't understand because it doesn't play like the original games. The it came before it, it played totally different and I just didn't understand it. And at the time I was like, ah, oh, this kind of sucks. I'll just, I'll just quit. <laughs> so, um, do I need to carry this stuff around with me? Can I repair this? Right click to use an item. Puts it in my hand. Can I click on, click on the star to pick a ritual? Oh, I need t one incense, three talisman. Okay. I don't have any talismans. What's this one? Items to unlock. Crude shovel, clay bowls. Okay, I can't do that one either. Pickaxe. Stone cutter's hut. Ornamented totem. Obsidian totem. So the first one's where we're starting. We just need... Oh, it only takes one incense. Report back to the elder. Okay, so I got this one. Sleep hut. So now I need three talismans. So I need to go back to the elder. Also, I'm running low on food. Kind of like grounded's build system. Yeah. Oh man, I keep forgetting. We we were kind of talking about playing that a while ago. And we never we never got to it. We should play that one day. I think we were going to the other weekend, but we decided it was already too late at night or something, and we never got back to it. Hey, get back here. Exile, have you made your hut yet? Indeed. Great. I see the gods find you to their liking. It's time you learn how to feed yourself. Craft a spear. You'll need it to catch fish. It's easy enough when you get to know these waters. I accept. All right, we gotta go catch some fish. Do I have anything else I can eat? I don't think so. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Grab a pencil and a piece of paper. Hey, official! I don't think that I will. <laughs> did you just skip over Black Flag? Oh, Black Flag. Yep. No. Yes. I did play that. And I loved it. Um, also, it was free on Ubisoft a while ago. Probably like a year or so. Maybe two years now. So, I had it on PlayStation. I have it on PC now. Um, and I actually made a video on it when it was free and I got it. So I'd love to play that again. I started playing uh, 3 Remastered on um, 4th of July weekend last year, two years ago, but didn't get far enough, didn't get that far into it. But yes, yeah, I forgot Black Flag. Uh, we gotta catch fish. What's going on, official? Grounded. I played it for a bit. I might not be interested in it. I thought that was dishonest message. Not that guy in Fortnite no more. Uh, I'm doing alright. Uh, we're trying out a game called Tribe Primitive Builder. And so far, it's pretty cool. How am I supposed to catch damn fish? <laughs> like that. <laughs> Get back here. Look, I'm a master hunter. I'm so good at this. <laughs> Why can't I hit him like this?
Oh, I got him. Oh, I was getting them. Okay. I missed. I got that one. How many fish do I have? Eight? Let's get ten. Nine. There we go. Where'd he go? There he is. Alright, let's get out of here. Ah, uh, let me out. So, so far I like this game. It, it plays a little bit similar to Ark, but without the constant danger and, and dying. There's my hut. There's my bed. I might have to sleep pretty soon. Got a zero seven on stream with an audience. Nice. Ever as before, if you end up getting unsatisfactory and I'm not there, there is a surprise for you in the hub chest. Uh oh. What is it? Oh, oh my gosh. I don't know if you guys were watching when Clockwork and I, uh, like when we were coming to the end of playing Satisfactory Wednesday, the game, my game crashed on me and it respawned me in the hub. We were a long way away and I lost everything I had. All my equipment, my jetpack, my legs, uh, everything I had just disappeared. But as long as I didn't. Oh no, I had... I may have had power shards on me. Crap, I should have just rolled the server back when we were there. The only thing... The only thing that can't be replaced in that game are power slugs and... hard drives. Everything else I wasn't worried about. I think I did have some power shards on me. Well, maybe if I got time, I'll just get on there and take a look. The gifts all around. That's really miss NV. Yeah, I wonder. I wonder exactly what's going on with him. If he's just sick and, you know, having a hard time with that and trying to rest and get better, or you know, if he's, if there's anything else going on. NV was in here. I think you guys were here. He was in here last night for a little bit. Seven deaths, no kills. I hope so too. I was going to tell him that, but don't like talking my feelings. Felt like a bitch. I know what you mean, man. I, I've i been struggling with that my whole life. <laughs> and I feel like I'm doing better at saying stuff and not feeling like a bitch. <laughs> For lack of a better word. Me and him need to play a co-op game. We... Better than 16 and 42. We should get him to come play Ark with us. I mean, he is good at that type of survival and building game. Uh, I feel like after he got the hang of it, he, he would like that. I don't know. Gonna text that, but I feel like I should have said it. it. Would have felt more genuine than by that time he was already gone. Why is everything turning purple? That was weird. Exile, have you caught some fish yet? I did. Great. Just remember to use the great gift of fire. Whoa! Uh oh. Volcano, the sound of explosion. Whoa!
Have you felt that? Fire Mountain grow angry with us means that gods disapprove of our ways. We must take a sacrifice to appease them anew. Go now, find our altar, burn some incense as an offering, show our respect to the gods and hope it makes them happy. On my way. Perform rituals at the altar to unlock access to blueprints for new buildings and items. Remember to check the cost of the ritual before going to the altar. O to open altar. Okay, let's cook some fishies. Wait, can I make spicy food? No. Oh, you can't leave the fire while it's crafting. Okay. I'd like to think that if you had chosen not now, the elder would have said, well, okay, fine. Instead of incense, you have volunteered to be our sacrifice. I kind of was wondering if he was going to say, we need a sacrifice and you will be just what we need. <laughs> Six, wait, four. I guess I can only do six at a time. Let's put that on eight. Perfect. There's a hole here. That's kind of dangerous. I wonder if I can hit the other people. Oh, I need to sleep. Imagine going into space with a BB gun and shooting at Earth. It's just a prank, bro. <laughs> there was a picture with an astronaut with a rifle when I was looking at that. Uh, oh. So I need talisman. Uh, I also need some water, so let's get a drink. So I wanted to build here because it's close to the water. All right, we're doing good. This tree is annoying. Whoa, look at that. That is cool. Is all this? Oh, what is that? Big leaves? Two logs. Two logs. Okay. Well, that was awesome. It's just a prank, bro. The prank. Well, guns would seemingly be fine firing in space. I'm thinking guns would provide some serious kickback. Oh yeah, if you were just floating and you shot a gun, it would propel you backwards because the force of the bullet going out would send you backwards. Uh, yeah. The suits are going to need amazing advanced thruster system to compensate for the backwards force applied by firing. The I wonder if the game actually does that while you're firing, it slows you down or makes you go backwards. Today's weather will consist of small plastic BBs. <coughs> I So what I was wondering, though, is because there's no air up there, right? So since there's no air, there's no sound because sound has to travel through the molecules in the air. Um, I was wondering if there's no air, there's no air resistance, that the bullet won't operate correctly because it's made to cut through the air and spiral to keep itself going straight but if you shoot it in space there's no air does that mean it works better or does it mess it up and it comes out and doesn't fly straight i i don't know that's what i'm kind of wondering play outer space music 
We used to find those little balls in our yard from our neighbor. It was the best thing ever. There was a bunch at a camping site we went to and Will kept finding them in the gravel. Little like neon green ones. Uh, Malik, I put the uh, link to this game in the chat if you scroll up a little bit. Anybody who wants to play, like all you guys can come play if you want to. It's free, free download. Paintball matches and zero G would be... Dude, I bet that if you got hit, it would push you back too. Not sarcastic. Oh, <laughs> hooray. <laughs> Downloading the game now. I was told they were seeds. Oh, the, the plastic BBs. So yeah, we can do that next, I suppose. I, I wanted to play this and I wanted to play one of those side scroller ones. Hey, wait, official, are you not at work? Or are, are you at work and just watching at work? <laughs> that just, I just thought of that, that you were, that you had to work and that's why we were going to play later. Try to plan them. This game is similar to Apex. Oh, the, the space one? Got sent home early. Oh! What's this thing is getting grazed in a space suit? Oh yeah, if you get hit once, you're done. <laughs> I don't know how far this game goes before the demo's done. Oh, there's the volcano. Okay. Oh, I'm probably supposed to follow this. Choose the ritual, press O, place the incense in the altar, wait for the ritual to complete. Hello. More fire, are there any chests over here? That fire sounds good. Pickaxe and some arrows. Where, where are we doing now? Place the incense on the altar. Wait for the ritual to complete. How long does it take? Did I not? Did I not incense correctly? That's interesting. Sleep hut unlocked. <coughs> I need three talismans. How do I make a talisman? 
Oh, this is where the incense goes, and I have to press E to place it down. Okay. Uh, inform the elder about your vision. Okay. Let's just go back and keep this going. Whoa. I missed a lot. I like how you do that sprinting thing with your hands, like you were Robert Patrick in Terminator 2. Like that cop from Cloudy with Chance of Meatballs. <laughs> YouTube asked me if a video I watched of a man getting shot in the back by officers and becoming paralyzed was fun to watch. <laughs> I never had anything like that from YouTube. I remember being so confused between between the two movies because I didn't realize the first time watching it, but later had conflicting memories of him being voiced by Mr. T and by Terry Crews. Did you say yes? Wait, what? Both those guys voiced him. Came here to tell you and it refreshed the page. Oh, did you say yes, that you liked it, that it was fun? Sent in Discord. Here it is. How fun was this video? Shot in the back. Quick update. $10 million lawsuit update. Not fun, fun, very fun, extremely fun. The most fun thing I've seen this week. <laughs> I've never had YouTube um, do that. All right, let's get this done so we can keep this moving and get done with it. I do like this game. I'll probably put it on my wish list. Might as well be gathering stuff while I'm running. Oh, wait. Stop it. And then while we're running, we might as well listen to this. Damn it, stop it. We might as well listen to this uh, amazing song. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You made a short. Wonder if YouTube needs a content upload tag that prevents. How much did you enjoy this? I got that, but asking me how satisfied I am with a photo or a suggestion. Sister uses my weight scale more than me. I told her ass to just keep that shit. My primitive gaming brain keeps registering the quest marker as a Mario coin. Oh yeah, I can see that. <laughs> I'll be on at around 12. Also going to wait until my family is asleep. Okay. Might just relax for a bit and come back. Um, so, but also we're going to be playing Project Playtime. So I was planning on playing that in about an hour and a half. I, I would rather play that one um, than the space one. So I'd rather do Project Playtime for sure, and then if we got time, we can do the space one. Cool. All right. Ah, Exile, have you performed the ritual? I did. 
I saw something strange, a vision, fire mountain was angry, fire everywhere, also a strange sign, and a big boat. I feel crazy. Aha, at last, the gods have chosen. You must be our savior. Now listen, we don't have time to read, to tread lightly, so you must save our fellow exiles. You must, okay, if the vision is true, the gods have already forsaken these lands. The tribe needs to grow. Without it, we can't build a boat great enough to save us all. No time to waste. The fire mountain turns more angry by the day. Big tribe will need a lot of food to sustain it. Make a sacrifice at the altar and bring er, and build a hut for the fishermen. I will do that. No time to waste. Craft Talisman 3. Okay, let me out of here. The cost of advanced rituals and special huts is high... Make your tribesmen work for you to collect enough resources and let you focus on management. Deliver tools to occupied huts. Provide food to the village storage. Press T to open tribe summary. I don't think clockwork knows. I'm literally the only black guy here. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, we got four sleeping places, four workers, zero, idle, four. Okay, so there's gonna be like an automation thing to it. We need food. Where do I take stuff? Whoa. Volcano. Craft three talismans. Oh, who are you? Hello, fresh meat. You should speak to our elder. Do what he tells you to do. We will speak later. Talisman. Incense. Talisman. I need at least three. Let's make six. Enjoy. <laughs> and Jippy, you pour relaxation time. See you when you get back on it. Also, I'm so proud Malik called me the N-word. <laughs> Trying really hard not to think of these tribe dudes as less magical Koroks. The best moment of my life. <laughs> uh, and also, I only have one, two, three, two. I don't have enough herbs. Play Breath of the Wild. Uh, I have it on Switch. That's why I want to get the damn uh, capture card that that actually goes uh, in my PC on my motherboard, so that I can stream things from the Switch and from PlayStation and stuff like that easier. Because right now, I don't think I have a way to connect the switch to my PC. What is this? Okay. I wonder what the hammer is for that I that I made.
I'm gonna cut some more trees. <laughs> ah! I'll just put these in my pocket. All right, where am I going? Unlocked Fisher's Hut. It's only on Switch, yeah. Not making sprinting as risky in games. Oh yeah. I hate that stamina. Man, this is awesome. You can just run. I, I wonder if it if it makes me more tired, but that's fine. I trip too, but I make epic saves. One time I slayed so hard. I slipped on ice right into the most fabulous pose you've ever seen. Nobody was around to see it. <laughs> Place a fisher's hut on the river. Use the map to find the river. Ah, here's the river. I'm gonna build it over by my house. Yeah, in a lot of these survival games, you've got like stamina for sprinting. So you can sprint for like 10 seconds and then you gotta wait for your stamina to refill. It's like, that doesn't, <clears throat> I don't know. It's, it's kind of a way to balance the game so it's not too, you know, like overpowered because I guess I'm talking about Ark and Ark is, a lot of people play it PvP, like PvP um, official servers, but I don't. So that kind of balances it for PvP, so you just don't have infinite running capabilities. And also the dinosaurs have stamina, like the flyers, when the stamina runs out, you, it lands. It just goes down and lands no matter where you are. And you can't take off again until your stamina refills. So if you run out of stamina, uh, you know, over some big dinos that are going to eat your face, they're going to kill you before you can take off again. So you got to be real careful. Uh, I need those to make more incense. And I think this too. All right, here's some more. I love cutting down trees in this. It's so cool. Can I pick that up? No. Wait, I wonder I wonder if I can cut this now. No. Okay. I could just run around collecting stuff all day. I don't know why. I don't know why I love it. <laughs> uh, let me get back to where I'm going to build this hut. I'll catch up on the chat here. Oh, here's my house. Pick a place for the... F oh, I missed a log. It's still here. That's cool. Okay. I was just moments when I'm sliding down a slope on ice and I managed to just stay on my feet right until I slide into dry ground. Bro zone. I 
You might say your spelling is imprecise. <laughs> Hey, oh my gosh, we're over we're over an hour. Holy crap. Okay. So, I guess you know what that means. If you'd like to support the channel, avoid the ads and join my private satisfactory server if you would like to. You can subscribe for $5 or for free with a Twitch Prime. If you connect your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, you get one free Prime subscription per month. And maybe if you're lucky, you could get gifted a sub, but it hasn't happened yet, so I wouldn't count on it. Here comes the 60 second ad break now. Okay. So what do we got? We have... Fisher's Hut. Cook's Hut. Okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, that's kind of cool. I want to make it so it touches both sides. Let's do it like that. Dude. That's awesome. I love the building. I mean, it's a little bit unnecessary to do all this, but it's it's kind of fun. Is that it? Build a bamboo totem. Finish all building phases one of six. Complete the con construction. Is this not constructed all the way? Okay. I don't know how to get guys to work for me. She gets some sleepy time. Craft a bamboo totem? Oh. What are those for? Incense five. Talisman. Incense five. All right, let's craft a bamboo totem. And then also a water skin. You know what? I'm going to make two of those. Got my snacks ready. I tried making a milkshake. I heard they bring all the boys to the yard. Oh, I got this. I found this at the store the other day. It's a... Uh, Strawberry banana. It's called, it says hard seltzer smoothie, but it tastes like a strawberry banana smoothie and it even feels like it, like you're drinking a smoothie. Um, it also has 5% alcohol in it. Like it's carbonated a little bit and it's got that thickness of a, um, of a smoothie. It's pretty cool. What does this do? The basic, oh, sorry. The basic ingredient of many rituals, burn it on the altar to appease the god, god, the gods. Okay. So it looks like I need, I need four more incense. Smooge. Yeah. Smooge. <laughs> I never actually read it. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so we have five for this one. This one is going to need three more incense and two more talismans. All right, might as well do this. Um, ah, man, I need two more grass. Any more grass. Damn right, it's better than yours. <laughs> I could teach you, but I had to charge. I forgot to bring down, Laura got me this giant, like, four gallon tin of popcorn from the popcorn factory. I was gonna bring it down here and show you how giant it is. Uh, for Valentine's Day. But I left it upstairs. Uh, I need some yellow grass. <laughs> Laura's sleepy. So, I heard something interesting the other day. Um, someone described something, uh, a measurement in spoons, but it was like a measurement of your energy. And they were talking about people with like autoimmune disease um, because you get really exhausted because your immune system is attacking. Oh, I'm super sleepy. Uh, your immune system attacks your healthy body cells. Like that's what Laura has. That's why her joints swell up. Um, so her immune system like attacks her own body and she gets super exhausted and the person was describing in spoons like how many spoons of energy you have left like when you wake up if you're completely perfectly rested maybe for example you'll have 10 spoons you can use throughout the day uh, but, you know, if you're not all the way rested, maybe you'll wake up, you're exhausted, get some sleep to regain your energy, you will find a bed. Okay, fine. Uh, maybe if you're not all the way rested, you might only have five spoons to use throughout that day. Spoons is a weird way to say it. I, I described it as action points. You wake up with a certain amount of action points you can use throughout the day. And when those action points are gone, then you're just exhausted and you pass out. Um, but yeah, she said that's like a perfect way to, uh, actually I better eat first so I don't die. She said that was like a perfect way to explain how she feels. Um, she's just extra exhausted more than like I, oh, there's one I missed up there. Like more than I would be. And it was, I didn't necessarily completely understand it uh, until I said that to her, like, action points. She's like, yeah, that's perfect. I only have so many action points I can use throughout the day. And then when those are gone, I'm going to sleep. No, come back. Uh, where'd the other one go? Did I miss one? Oh, two. Dude, I, I love this game. This is awesome. I'm surprised. I was expecting it... I was expecting it to not be very good, or to at least be kind of like mediocre, but I feel like it's actually really good. I wonder if these grow back too. I don't want to cut all these down around my house. That's why I built my house here. Uh, maybe I should go back here and do it. And then also, if she eats some of the stuff that I've talked about before, like she's allergic to rice and corn and stuff like that, if she eats anything like that, <clears throat> her her joints will swell up really bad. Like finger joints, knees, hips, stuff like that. Okay. Spoons of energy, I've not heard. I had neither until like a day or two ago. 
Gonna go for a bit, but I'll be back in about an hour. Uh, okay. Uh, so that'll be, yeah, right around 10 o'clock my time. So, sounds perfect. Rheumatoid arthritis. No, it's... It's... It's very close to lupus. But not exactly. Um... I forgot what kind of name. They gave it, like... A name that just basically means they don't really have a good name for it. Uh... But it's, it's really close to lupus, I think. Yay! Alright. Finish all the building phases. Wait, am I not... Oh, I'm still not done. <laughs> I keep thinking I'm done with this. Oh no, I'm out of yellow grass again. There's some over here. Ah! Oh, there's some. up here oh that's what the bamboo totems are for cool Oh, I can fill up my water skin. Oh, it is full. Disposable container, full water skin. Okay. My daughter has JRA, just RA now, but highly processed foods trigger a slow inflammation that requires steroid injections to counter. Yeah. Oh, what is that? Oh, I can... Oh, this is where I add people. Yeah, we're kind of... So, our house here, it's it's more difficult because... I mean, it's more difficult than it used to be. Because she can't have corn, rice, tapioca, which there's like tapioca starch and in, in a lot of stuff too. Uh, I can't think of anything else at the moment. So, like, she can't have that stuff. Uh, my son and I can't have gluten. And all of the gluten-free stuff is made out of corn, rice flour, um, tapioca flour, almond flour, which I think she can have. So, she can't have the food that we have to eat, and we can't have the food that she has to eat. So... <laughs> we kind of have to uh, make two different, not not two different entire meals, but for example, like if she'll make some some really good sauce, and then make gluten free pasta and regular pasta, things like that. A bit of a juggling act, yeah. And we all just kind of have to pay attention to what we're eating, but we're good at it now. It's it's not really a problem anymore. It does kind of make everything just a little bit harder though. All right, so this place needs a spear. What if I put my spear in here? There we go. Replace totem? Workers.
Stock up on food rations in the village warehouse? Okay. Okay. Uh, I think I just need to catch a whole bunch of fish. And then cook them. And put them in the village warehouse. Alright, well, you know what? I think... I think I've played this game enough to say that I like it, and I would I would buy it. Um, let's talk to this guy first just to see what happens. So I think I would like to move on to the next one. Greetings, what is new? Fishing hut's done. It's good, time to make the tribesmen work. Bring tools, place a torch in the totem by the hut's door. More torches means more workers. The signal seems simple enough. Make sure to prepare food. Tribe needs to eat here. Okay. Got it. I will take this food to the stash, then bring tools to the fishermen's. I think I got it. I have nine foods. Where? Oh, down here? Okay. Food? Report back to the Elder. Okay, cool. So this is really close. So I don't have to run all the way back into the village. What's new? I brought the tools. Brought the tools. Also the torches are placed in the totem. Whoops. We need to grow our tribe. We're going to survive fire mining. Okay. Talk to our scout, he will help you find more exiles. Okay. Well, cool. I like it. Is this guy right here? Oh, he's going up there. Alright. I'm I'm kinda wasting time right now. Uh okay. I like this game. I would buy it. I think I I would like to buy it. I'd like to play it again. Save name. Game saved. Okay. Save and quit. Share your feedback. What's that going to do? Open Steam. Oh. Play test. Thank you for playing. Join our Discord. Uh, you can add screenshots. Have you encountered any bugs? No. Was the game mechanics tutorials clear? Yes. Okay, I'll leave this window up and I'll do this. I'll do this uh, later. I really like it. I like this game a lot. Are you sure you want to exit? Yes. Add to wish list. Actually, I have to do it this way. Tribe. Add to wish list. Join the tribe primitive. Oh, request access? Oh, hell yeah. The gods have shown me. A I've requested access to the playtest. This comes out quarter three of this year. Oh, it's still a while. Okay. Um, what is next? I have Planet of Lana. That's one of those side scroller ones that we were looking at the other night. Uh, Sons of Valhalla, that's the Viking side-scroller one. Desynced. What was that one? You all do fun tricks like different color bulls and Tupperware to designate the gluten, gluten-free stuff. Uh, not necessarily. Um, I have been confused before about what was in a certain Tupperware, whether it was gluten-free or or her gluten stuff. Um, so normally we can figure it out there. 
for the most part, everything is gluten free. Except for like her specific pasta. Uh, and then sometimes she'll make like a pie or some cookies or something that's not gluten free. But yeah, for the most part, it's most of it's gluten free because she'll use there's like she has some flour like arrowroot powder is another gluten free flour um, that she can use. So she uses that. Um, almond flour so she just doesn't use like rice flour or corn starch um, so that she can we can both eat it for the most part it's just basically things like bread we have special gluten-free bread and pasta are I guess are the big ones uh, what was I doing Oh, I was looking for D de synced. What was this one? Oh, this was the city builder one. Oh, that looked cool too. Okay. I do want to play that, but I think this is the one I want to play right now. So if you don't know what this song is, um, there was a video that it just kind of, you know, I'll just show you. <laughs> uh, let me see. Okay, I found it. This video. Milliliters per ejaculate. And then when you get all the way down to the end. Oh, wait, I went too far. So these are all the ones that they did. Like here's donkey man is down here somewhere. Blue whale 20 liters. King Kong 467. <laughs> Godzilla 3,266. Anyway, that's where that song came from. <laughs> anyway. Oh no, my keyboard and my mouse are broken. Stop. Hold on, I gotta fix it. So, I can't tell. I don't know. 
if that's a problem with my mouse, my keyboard, or my motherboard, because it'll start doing that by itself, it's still doing it. Dang it, man, stop. Hold on, let me just restart the game and see, see if that helps. It, it usually stops after I unplug them and replug them. Oh, it says to use a controller. Okay. Let's try that. Okay. My arrow. Okay. That's weird. What the hell is happening? Holy crap, man. Grabbing a snack. I might as well turn to the restroom. Let me try this controller. Why? Okay. Oh no. Why? Please stop. <sighs> Come on.
I have no idea. I don't know that it's my stuff messing up. It could just be the game. But I think I got everything set to the way I want it. <laughs> uh, and then I can adjust volume over here. All right. What is this called? I forgot what the game's called. Planet of Lana. Let me update my title. Planet of Lana. Okay, we're updated. Man, we're coming up on two hours, so I'm just gonna go ahead and run the 60 second ad break now. If you'd like to support the channel, avoid the ads, and join my private satisfactory server and come play along with us if you would like to. You can subscribe for $5 or for free with a Twitch Prime. By connecting your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, you get one free Prime subscription per month. I hope you use it here. Here's a 60 second ad break now. All right, let's do it. Tea stealer, what's going on? If I were president, I would be president for life. Well, they kick you out after four years or they make you get reelected. And then after eight years, you can't do it anymore for the rest of your life. How are you? I haven't seen you in a while. Doing good? Cool. Good to see you. Good to see you over here. Focusing with school and life? Yeah. I get it. It's a bit loud. Let me adjust this here. <laughs> we are going to be playing a game called Project Playtime later. It's like Poppy Playtime, uh, but it's a uh, multiplayer like survival one. Whoop. Okay. Why? Okay. I see. Am I stuck down here forever now? <laughs> okay. I see. Stop. Hold. To follow? Hold what? Okay. Is it too quiet now? Right now. Not. You should run for president. I wanted to <clears throat> run for president just because we haven't had a president that's not a millionaire.
for about 70 years, so... I wanted to be like the normie president, the broke... Ah, oh, man, I'm getting screen tearing. Damn it, man. This sucks. Need V-Sync on. Uh, I had it on, okay. 60. No! Oh, shit. This is messed up. Oh, I have it. Borderless full screen, okay. Now we gotta let it go all the way through its thing. 120? Oh, crap. No! God damn it, man. It's broken. I don't know why. I can't get it to work right, though. All I wanted to do was turn VSync on. Okay. Okay. I've done it. Yes. Can you fall down in the game? Yeah, I did. I had to climb back up. Is your controller... And I tried the controller too. It didn't work any better. It was exactly the same. Where did official go? I don't know. It's supposed to be back, I think. Yeah, should be back later. What is this? Oh, stop. Hey, Mommy. I see. Whoa. Okay. Cool. Yeah, there was an earthquake in Syria and Turkey. Yep. 28... 28k? I haven't heard in a few days. People are still alive? It's been long enough now that if they don't have any food or water, plus it's super cold that I didn't think that anybody would be left Ima. Ima. What am I supposed to do now? Oh! Whoa. Don't die. Alright, I think I'm about to get him from the other side. Oh, what's that? Okay. What? The rock is following me. Hey! Did you see that? What are those guys? Are they gonna hurt me? Okay. be part Jack Russell Terrier. Play a mobile game? Why? <coughs> 
You could probably get this game on mobile. Actually, I play Kingdom. Kingdom's on mobile too. Hold what? I can't see. Hold E, hold space. Hold up. Hold R, hold T. What? Oh. Bamaki. Bamaki. I see. Jump. <laughs> Oh, I see. Knock that down. Wait, how am I supposed to tell him to knock it down? Oh, okay. He just kind of did it. Classmate pulling down the pants of your classmate? Oh, come along. Let's go. What time is it? 9.24. Okay, we got about a half an hour to play this until people are coming back and we're going to be playing Project Playtime. Can I make that jump? I guess we're going to find out. Woohoo! <laughs> It's just like crunch. <laughs> uh, cat knocked something down off a ledge. No, it's never happened before. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, wow. Am I supposed to jump down there? I don't see how I can get up there. Hmm. After the two hour mark add time. Oh, did I do it? Oh, I did it. I did it right before you might have been you might have been uh, getting a snack or something I did it right before I started This is nice. I like these kinds of games. Uh oh, scary. Oh, there goes the rock. Hey, what are you doing? Tamaki. Get him. Hola, I'm muy. Can I go up here? No. Can I go up here? Imagine there was a monster. Uh oh. I'm sure there'll be some type of monsters. Eventually. What? What's the point of that? I supposed to do here?
Tamaki, mui. Tamaki. I don't see what I'm supposed to do. At least this kid's got a a flurkin. <laughs> oh, wait. Can I go up there? Hold on, let me see. Yeah, I don't know what that is. It, I don't think it's a cat. Some kind of animal from this planet. All right, give me the give me the vine. Okay. I really don't know what to do. Tamaki. I can't go any further. Tamaki. Hmm. Ah! Really? Okay. That's what we're doing. I think we found the monster. Ah, move! Don't, I can't, I can't. Ah! I couldn't point to the right spot. Okay, well at least we know that's what's going on. <laughs> that's crazy. Go, 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 go. Tamaki. Get up here, get up here, get up here, get No! Okay, at least I'm over here. Oh, cool. Jeez, man. That was crazy. Hola, I'm muy. <laughs> Throwing a rock like what David did to Goliath? I guess it wanted to eat my little guy. Tamaki. Uh... Tamaki. Hmm. Tamaki mui. Tamaki. Mm-mm. Now what do I do with this? Tamaki. Tamaki. Tamaki mui. It might be. I don't know what to do with this. Oh! Okay. Get this guy. How do we save this guy? I don't think I can. Huh. Come 
aquí, muy. This is pretty cool. Hola. There you go. Ooh, what's that? There's a hole. What? Oh, it came out over there? Oh. That's cool. That's not what I thought was going to happen. Escort quest, the game. I don't even know what we're doing. We just kind of woke up. And now we're... We're just going. Can I make that? Uh, oh. Make it, make it, make it, make it. Oh. That was a big jump. Like, we're obviously not on Earth. Doing what so many protagonists must do travel to the right. Yeah. The right is the way to go. <laughs> There was a point in, what was it, Far Changing Tides, where we had to travel to the left. It's crazy. Those games are really cool. Far Lone... Or Far... Far Lone Sails and Far Changing Tides. They're pretty awesome. Okay. Okay. How do I push this thing? Oh. Oh, I think I'm gonna have to pull those boards off to get in there. What does this do? Um Okay, I think this is what I gotta do. Push this over here. is dangling a string and cat isn't attacking it <laughs> is this gonna kill me oh okay <coughs> yeah that's unrealistic <laughs> oh wait stay there it got electrocuted now I need to move this back Okay. Actually, can I move this? I can. Ah, I see. We. There's some more of these creatures on the ceiling here. What are you guys doing? Hanging out. Uh-oh. 
What is this? Oh, hide in grass? Oh. There's your monsters. Spider robots, what is this? Breath of the Wild? Go, 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 go. Nothing? I'm hiding. Ah! Go, 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 go! Whoa. <laughs> okay. I figured all these controls out now. Let's go. I like that it shows the little guy's animation in the little window. It shows he's running after me. Oh no, what is this? Look at that. These kinds of games are so cool. When they got scenes like that. I played one a little while ago. I think it was called Planet Alpha. We played it for a couple hours and it's it's like on an alien world that's being attacked by robots and stuff. Um, and that was really cool too. We never got back to it though. Can I make this up here? Uh, nope. Is there anything up here to, to get? Can you go up here? Nope, okay. I wonder how long this demo is. Oh! Oh! Go, go, go! Okay. Is that thing gonna stay there? Yep. I wanna see my little guy. Tell him to go back from up here. Run, 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 run. Okay, you stay here. Don't get eaten. I'm surprised there's no music right now. <laughs> it's so funny.
Jeez. I was like, oh no, he's gonna get me. I didn't see the grass here. Oh no! I didn't mean to stand up. Ah, oh, damn it. Minimal ambience. Yeah, I'm there's like there's plenty of sounds and stuff, but I was just like, I'm surprised there's no like nice music. That's cool music actually for that guy. All right, where's he gonna come out? Oh, uh, I was gonna make a run for it, but... Oh, he's in the grass? Why? Stand. Okay, I think I understand. This is gonna be this might be difficult. Oh <laughs> keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh no. Oh, jeez. No, why? Okay. Oh, damn it. I need to be back over there. I can't reach... Can't reach it from here. Run, 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 run. Okay. I need him up here. I didn't think you'd go up there and get him. Oh, hey. Planet of Lana. Yeah, it's it's really cool. I got this little little cat looking guy with me and I can tell him to do stuff like this. Let's wait till it comes back over here and then turns around. How am I going to get him back down here? <laughs> Clever droid. <laughs> hmm. What am I supposed to? Can you use Kitty as distraction from up on the ledge? Well, I have to get that down so I can jump up there. But after it falls, he hears it and comes up. Oh, what the hell? Uh. Cat has to be up there to drop the... Yeah. So the cat drop... He drops the logs. Oh, get down. Damn it. And then I don't know what... Because it comes so fast. I don't know what to do with him after he drops the logs. Maybe I need to run. Ah, <laughs> damn it. I don't, I don't know. 
You have Kitty on the platform while the cat... While you act as a distraction. Oh, get it to chase you and cat drops the logs. Okay. Well, so the problem was I was over there underneath the rock and I couldn't reach this up here. So if I... Oh no! If I go underneath that that rock on the right side, I can hide there, but I can't reach this to tell him to do it. Oh no! Oh no! Run, 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 run! Alright, I'm gonna try that. Maybe I can get it to run underneath the logs? Oh, yes! Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, so, see this little white dot here at the logs? It can only go that far, so I can't reach right here while I'm underneath there. So I thought I wouldn't be able to tell him to, but if he's already up there, I can command him to do it while I'm further away. Okay, let's go, kitty. <laughs> Woohoo! Uh, so officials here, I guess we're just, uh, waiting for Malik to come back and then we can get started. Come on, kitty. Actually, when everybody's here and ready, I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break. Oh, look at that! <laughs> this is probably the end, actually. Gonna try going live on Twitch tonight? Hell yeah! Do it! That'd be cool. There's actually not a lot of requirements to be to become affiliate. 